ladies, gentlemen, Ben, give it up. Today's presentation is fairly broad. As you can see, this is what you might have been told on Meetup. Uh, I need to have a full disclosure that it says without office, and I started renting an office. Just wanted to be clear that this has changed. But the basics of my presentation is how, um, actually an other thing that Eli said is a one-man shop on the presentation, and part of that is, is, a, is how much of a, a complete misnomer it is, and the entire presentation about how you can scale yourself or your organization to be incredibly productive uh, thanks to the internet. Thanks to the internet because originally, back in the old days of the 90s and the early 2000s, people got really excited about Google because it was sorting the internet because the internet was just about accessing information. And uh, for my generation that seems perplexing, but uh, one of the things is that your organization almost guaranteed was born before the internet was. Your organization was likely developed with working habits that preceded the internet. And, and that might not make sense yet, but we'll keep going on that. But probably it isn't making the most of the internet either. Put your hand up if you use Microsoft Outlook. Hmm? Yeah. Not making the most of the internet for sure. Um, probably isn't nearly as productive as it could be. And, and this is going to like, be the point I'm going to hammer again and again and again. First, a little bit about me. Um, put your hand up if you don't see a number. Well, that's not really fair. It might be like very faded to you, but uh, put your hand up if you don't see the number six there. You're almost guaranteed to be a male, so if you don't see it, it might just be because it's faded. And not an all people person, and to be honest, that takes a lot to say that. Not to say that I'm not extroverted and can't give presentations, uh, but not quite a relational person. Uh, so that might lead you to believe. Well, Eli said I could hire him. Why the hell would I? This is like, where's the sell here? But, but trust me, I love marketing. And, and so one of the things is, um, what does sort of the Frontier team do in a, a given month? And this is a brief example. I tried to cover it. We uh, coded one website from Drupal to WordPress. We took two crappy websites that were on WordPress and built beautiful custom themes three e-commerce donation systems that are capable of processing up to a million dollars per year, two entire nonprofits have their entire donation history reviewed, visualized, and set with KPIs. So the team then combined 655 hours in the month of October. And if you think you're more productive, put your hand up, and I will stare at you for the entire presentation. All right, you're the focus of my presentation from now on. All right, so clearly, um, ha not having employees isn't hindering me from helping a lot of organizations. And, and part of it is, what do you need to do uh, to focus on having a more sort of productive lifestyle, and what digital tools will help you get there? Some of you might go, oh man, I know these so well. Um, put up your hand if form stack is unfamiliar. Oh, so helpful for me. Thank you very much. Um, and lastly, pay most of it. So that means I'm losing unseen productivity. And not just productivity, uh, if you're a nonprofit and you do fundraising, you are leaving cash on the table. Box, this should be dead simple. If you're not using Dropbox yet, I feel like I've done you a service. This is our list: concept, purgatory, content, design. We're working our way through production line. To do another free app. So so far, I'm you're in the hole, zero dollars per month. And then a lot of you here are those that uh, represent a charity and. Uh, might just represent the content or idea of building a website. A-B testing, I will not go into the depths of the amazingness of A-B testing, but on December 4th, return, and you will go into the, the depths. Blow your mind, yes.